All right, what up guys, this is uh, Mike and Mulio's photoresistor tutorial. Uh, here we have our photoresistor. Ours isn't blue. Um, and here this is what it looks like from the top. And this is what it looks like when it is really tiny, attached to our breadboard. Just this little bit right here. And what it is, this is the resistor. But, depending on how much light it's receiving, hence a photoresistor, the resistance is going to be either really high or really low. Here we have our good old multimeter. And what we're going to do is we're going to demonstrate, show you how the resistance changes in the presence of light or not. Right now we're not in the most well-lit room at the moment, so Jack's going to go ahead and shine the flashlight on the photocell. Oh, it can also be called a photocell. And as you can see, right now, our scale is approximately 200,000 ohms again. So, but as far as our scale is concerned, there is very little. Sorry about that, Jack. It's OK. There's very little, very low resistance. However, if it is then covered by, say, I don't know, Jack's shirt, you'll see the resistance goes up to, say, I don't know, around 25, oh, to well, almost, 40. Yeah, say, about 30,000 ohms. This is great if you need to say, I don't know, make a Brittenberg bug. Okay, this is Mike and Mulio with their video. Now stop.